Hello everybody and welcome back to Better Minecraft. Now we're in a different room. Uh, I decided to transfer all my stuff from this big building right here that I'm eventually going to turn into something to this tiny room in the alley. This is a little bit better because I can actually turn this into an actually functional storage room eventually. Right now it's just hiding my shulker box monster. You know, as you have to, because these things get can get pretty massive. And I did go through and resort all this, so now I don't have boxes full of random stuff. It is pretty much sorted. I do have boxes with, like, some random bits and pieces, but I've more broadly sorted those. And then found out exactly how much of certain materials I had. Like, I know I need more stone. Uh, just random spruce bits. It's just... Some of them it was pretty hard to sort out, but other ones it was a lot easier to just go ahead and get them all sorted out. But this isn't even the extent of it. I still have to go grab some actual chests because all of these are full now too. Uh, I moved everything that was in this one into these four little boxes here. So I can just run back up here, grab them whenever I grab my boxes, and then move them back there. But that is not the focus for today's video. Uh, in between episodes, I did fix all my gear. As you can see, I have been flying around with my elytra, so that's probably a little bit more broken. But I did have uh, more of the botany pots growing flax down there, so now I actually have a full box of flax and building materials for us to make more buildings along this path, because that's going to be one of our main focuses for today. Our main focus is going to be here. I've got to get the rest of this guy done. Uh, specifically, I want to get down this side so I can actually decorate this back piece here. And then I want to finish off this side. Essentially, anything we can see from land side, I want to finish that. There is now pillagers going through my forest. Hi, guys. Nothing to see here. I really need to get some iron golems on this side. Also... Another fun thing I did, speaking about iron golems, that how they like to pack down the snow in certain areas, I got rid of all the snow over here. Well, at least most of it. There's some still in, like, random spots and random places. But a good majority of the snow that was, like, back here, that is now all gone. I also need to... I'm actually going to do this in between episodes. But I want to put some more time into... Figuring out exactly the buildings and stuff that are going to be going on back here. Because I know this pin, I want it to go across this and actually match up with that tower right there. So I want to put the tower entrance at an angle and actually have the fence go all the way up to it. And actually go all the way around this building. And continue this wheat field up. I want to continue the wheat field feeling going up. And I also want to do another entrance, continue the, kind of the pathway along here, and make another entrance to the beach down there. Just some ideas for later. But none of that has to do with today's episode. That's just what I'm going to be doing in between episodes. Today's episode, worrying about this thing, because there is still so much of this that has to get done. Okay, essentially what I have to do is, this guy's kind of already started, but I have to bring out the dirt pieces out by two. I think I've already done that for the most part on this side. I think I went mostly to the water on this side. Yeah, I went down this entire expanse right here. But now I have to do that on this side as well. I also have to figure out what I want to do across all of this. Okay, there we go. Dirt. All the way around, there's some random red merchant here, but we're not going to worry about that. Okay, now, in order to do two out this way, I'd have to do this, this, and of course these two would match up. So, I think I want to continue this little stone piece forward a bit. And still bring these out by two. And there we go. Now, all the way around, we have our starting, like, rim areas. 
all the dirt goes out by two and all the stone goes out by one from the original platform. Now, I have to put in all the decor bits. I have to figure out where the stairs are going to sit. I have to figure out how I want each area to look. Also, uh, I left off last video not sure if I wanted to add more grapes to this. I did, in fact, go through and add more. As you can see. It just the wall felt very empty, so I just decided to put more on there. There we go. And texturing really just brings everything kind of together. Of course, I still have to do the texturing on the darker part. I do have texturing blocks for that. As you can see, I textured through here. I just got to get through and actually texture all of this, which is a whole project all its own. And there we go. And that is just a small taste of what I'm about to do to this entire thing, because I still have to go all the way across the back of it. That's already been textured a tiny bit from what I had on there originally, but I've got to go all the way around. I never even finished the texturing back here. Whenever I did this original bit here, I didn't go all the way back, so it's going to take me a bit to get through all of this. Okay, I've gotten bored. <laughs> I know, didn't take all that long. I didn't plan on doing this in an episode, but I keep getting distracted whenever I'm not recording an episode. So, you know, we're going to get a little distracted here. Speaking about distractions, I have another distraction coming right up. Uh, I want to do a little bit of a platform off of this. Okay. I have everything else for these. But I want to continue, like, this kind of dock-looking look that we have right here. And I want to do another one of those elevated platforms over here. Because right now, this area isn't really, like, usable in the state it's in. But I do want to use it. So... Yeah, that definitely helps with the blending from this area into this area. So now, from the water line, it looks a lot better. I do need to add back in a few of the trees. I actually need to take that one down because the leaves did not decay properly. And then I need to re-put in some of the trees. Okay, and there we go. Trees are back in. I had to take down quite a few of them in order to even get this thing in place. And none of them look too bad when you're actually in here. That one actually grew over the lamppost, which feels great. That one's kind of blocking the balcony, but they, then again, the original one was too. There we go. Just another hangout spot that I can decorate later. Uh, I do need to get some spruce trap doors for this. Just because it, it's probably going to blend better now that I have spruce here and not sand. Okay, and now that I've figured out this beachside area, I want to get back on this. Okay, I do any more of this texturing and my brain's probably going to implode. Uh, I have a lot of issues doing stuff in pure silence and uh, whenever I'm recording, I have to sit in pure silence or else I can't focus. It, it's it's a weird thing. I, I don't question it. I have attention issues. <laughs> That's the only excuse I have. Uh, but I can... Either I can, it can be really quiet and I can lock in on something if it's something that I can really focus on and something that I'm really intrigued by. But when it is texturing a wall... Needless to say, my brain is not intrigued by this. Is it going to have a great final product? Yes. Am I completely and utterly frustrated the fact that I am stuck here texturing a wall? Yes. I only have a little bit of it left, by the way. I only have this little chunk in the back left. But I think I'm a little bit more burnt out on this than I expected because I was doing the bottom parts texturing and actually texturing all the stone. At the same time, I was trying to figure out these stone pieces to just texture the wall in general. So, my brain needs something else to do. 
So we are going to go find something else to do. That's the reason I had the whole explosion with the, uh, this thing. Ow. Just face first into it. Great idea. The whole break I had with this, I just, I need something else. I, I can't just sit here and not do something else because this, this is not entertaining to me. Just sitting there building a wall, not entertaining. What is an entertaining thought, though, is trying to figure out where the heck I want to put these guys. Because I have four skeleton horses just sitting here, chilling. I don't know where to put them. I know I need to move them over in this area somewhere. Because a lot of our livestock is on this main island. None of it's over here. So I need to put it over here somewhere. Just don't quite know where to put them. I feel like the horses would be a great addition to maybe our military force or maybe helping haul things out of the mines. I mean, these are skeleton horses, so who knows how much use that's going to be, but I feel like it's more in tune with being over here. So I think I'm going to move these guys up here next to the mines hey. real quick. The Bones crew has now been moved from... The island to where they can actually make some sense. Uh, this is actually where I plan on putting the warehouse for this area. So maybe I can integrate them somehow. I don't want to get rid of them. I do, in fact, want to keep the skeleton horses. But we don't have a stables, which is probably a flaw on my part. Planning on putting like a stables or something out this way. Just buy one of the gates is more my idea maybe we can put one more down here i mean i do need to clear out a bit more of the space so maybe we can end up putting a stables like in this area somewhere i mean it's right next to one of the guard towers so it's definitely an idea okay since we're already down over here and I need a break from that area over there, I want to put in kind of where the road is going to go. I know we have these yellow pieces here, but I think I want to establish where the main road is going to go. Which means I need my dirt box. Yep. And I'm just going to quickly dig out just... Straight from here and down to there. Because that is main road. So we're going to bring this spot and connect it to that spot. That's the new goal for today because I am bored. Okay, about five stacks of coarse dirt later and we have a path. Now, I didn't really control my shovel too much when I was digging this out because I didn't want it to feel very straight lined I did want it to kind of curve a bit I did want like some more peeking out bits and stuff I wanted this road to be a little bit more rough around the rough around the edges now rough around the corners rough around the edges and I still do have a little bit where I want to go off this way and connect this road to this as well but I want to get these buildings in before I do that and this goes all the way down and completely meets this path. I didn't skimp on this. It goes all the way down. But this lines us up in next episode. We'll do a bit on that. We'll do some more texturing on that. Uh, we'll do some texturing on the road. And then we'll start getting some more buildings in. Those two are definitely going up in the next episode. I want to go ahead and get this area kind of figured out and I want to start getting this beach side stuff figured out too because I need to extend this dock on this side and I need to figure out where I want the natural beach to end and where I want this dock to start so that I can actually get this full thing in and get some more dock side buildings going up because this is not going to be the only like port side type stuff this is this is a peninsula after all so I do want some more uh, 
kind of dockside housing. So this little piece right here is going to come out a bit further and then it's going to come along the front of this. Just to kind of ma make everything match. And I may end up going under the water and actually uh, making some of the water more shallow to do another one of these beach things over here somewhere. Maybe. But that is going to be all for this episode. We worked on the elevated platform over there. We finished up this road. We moved the horses down here. And we even built in a whole new little dock piece over here that wasn't even in the plans to be made. This is what happens when I get bored. So, we've actually done quite a bit in this episode. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye!